Is that your signature? No. She's out of the country. House after house, person after person, and no one we spoke with knew a thing about state Senate candidate Mark Sims. Do you know who Mark Sims is? Mark Sims, no. But they should know who he is. Their names show up on a list of petitions Sims filed with the state to qualify for the ballot. But it now appears some of those signatures may have been forged. Are you sure that's not your signature? Not at all. Do you want me to show you my signature? <laughs> sure. Camille Tomlinson showed us how different her signature is from the one that appears on the petition. That's not my signature. It doesn't even look like it at all. Sims was not available for an interview, but blames one of the men hired to collect the signatures. Clifford Curry. We tried to track down Mr. Curry, but we didn't have any luck. But the address he left on this document right here led us to this homeless shelter here in Phoenix. Sims is still on the ballot as of this afternoon. Only his opponents can challenge the legitimacy of the signatures and his candidacy. But these voters say there is nothing legitimate about these signatures. Very disturbing. It's just sad, isn't it? Dennis Welch for Arizona's Family.